Russian army restores old military equipment due to shortage at front. Russian army restores old military equipment due to a shortage of vehicles at the front, according to Atesh Partisan Movement. Atesh agents conducted a reconnaissance of a warehouse of non-working equipment of one of the military units in the Gagarin district of Sevastopol. As it turned out, the Russian soldiers restored equipment from this warehouse for military needs. This demonstrates that the enemy has significant problems with military equipment, which once again con confirms the information from our agents from the Russian armed forces. The partisan said, Atesh agents also spotted a Russian radar system located near a military unit in Sevastopol. Having launched a full-scale war against Ukraine, Russia has been unable to abandon the use of Soviet-era military equipment despite boasting in previous years about the production and supply of modern equipment to their troops. This new equipment includes the T-72B3M, T-80BVM and T-90M main battle tanks, BTR-82A armoured personnel carriers, BMP-2M infantry fighting vehicles, BMPT terminator fire support vehicles along with various others. The massive losses of Russia's newest military equipment in the first months of the invasion has led to Russia being forced to reactivate and refurbish older models for deployment in order to plug capability gaps incurred through losses. Since the start of the war, Russia has removed approximately over 40% of its Soviet-era tanks and armoured personnel carriers from the largest mothballed equipment base in Buratia. This certainly represents a significant figure, but Russia has another 20 smaller, similar storage bases which can also be used to reconstitute units destroyed in combat. As high-intensity military operations continued, the share of modern military equipment in Russian stocks has fallen, leading to greater reliance on older Soviet-era equipment in many units. Thank you.